Hey guys, it's Ashley, your Scrapping Nerd, and I have day 11 of 31 days of cut file fun from MK at Some Assemblage Required, so make sure you go check out her channel. Um, so these are the pictures of us hiking in Sedona, and I had this wood grain from my stash, and then this uh, DCWV paper pad adventure. I used um, some papers from here, and I forgot to show the cut file. And so I started working on it, and it's um, a hiking boot that says hike at the at the bottom. And so I, what I did was I took my markers there and just colored the outline of the word hike. And then what will happen is I will then take the letters and I will use the um, embossing, distress embossing tea dye, and tea dye those and then put them back so that just the word hike has texture. And the rest of the cut file I backed with paper and then I did use um, some embroidery thread for the tie for the boot. I, t I cut off the paper tie and then just made holes and tied my own tie. And so the wood grain is looks more like the tree bark and so that's gonna be the very back and then I liked this green paper and so I had this picture of my husband hiking next to this mountain and then I had the picture of the mountain and so I thought it'd be kind of cute if I butted them up next to each other so it kind of looks like one continuous picture of the mountain um, and so that's what I'm doing here is trying to just kind of line it up so it looks like one full mountain there and so I'm liking how that's looking and I really like this cup file here. Um, I didn't really have to do much to in terms of embellishment for this page because of the cup file. And then I decided I wanted some circles of the different patterns that are within that um, paper pad. And so I'm using the We Are Memory Keepers uh, circle cutter. And I also have this arrow punch and I'm cutting out some arrows from the paper pad as well. And I just like the idea of having all these different patterns kind of represented on this page. And um, the white one has that foil to it. It's got that gold foil with the arrows. And so I'm liking how that is coming along. And so I wanted to work on some uh, embellishment clusters. And so this is the 13 Arts uh, Travel the World. And so I took the trees and um, the backpack, some hiking boots, and a camera. So I think it's making a nice little cluster um, on this circle on the bottom right. And then I took some um, from, I have some Echo Park stickers in my stash that I'll also use. And I'll put up there just some sayings. Um, up on the white circle as well. So it kind of just has two areas for some embellishment clusters. So I want to get this cut file glued down because I know that that's where I want that to go. It's really cute. I like that cut file a lot. And so here's where I'm putting some some of these Echo Park uh, stickers that I have in my stash. It says escape, One the that little one says what a trip. And then the black one will say adventure is worthwhile. So I thought that that was cute just to put over that circle. I thought that it had a lot of white all of a sudden. And so I wanted to put the stickers over that cut file, or I mean that circle, so that um, it wasn't so stark white. And then I'm really liking how this orange looks with this green. I did it on one of the other layouts earlier in the month. And so I just wanted to put a couple strips of the orange um, on the top and the bottom of the layout just to add another layer. And then put my little arrows here going up the side. And I had them going up because we're you know hiking up this, this mountain in Sedona. And then this paper is uh, gold foil trees. And so I thought a little strip would be cute on the side. It just kind of plays off that white circle that also has the gold foiling. And so... That is the layout. I, thank you to everyone that has liked and subscribed to my channel. I really appreciate it. If you haven't yet, go ahead and hit those buttons down below. Make sure you check out all the people that are playing along with 31 Days of Cut File Fun. Um, all the information is in the description box below. Thanks, everyone. Have a great day.
Bye.